Well, hi guys. Before I post that other video out there, I'm going to say this. I never like bullies of any sort, and I don't even like the ones we've got in the office right now. Nor do I like the ones that we have formed as our government, let alone the people we keep associating with. I think they're the lowest form of life. For someone who keeps picking on women left and right, and those who keep picking on women left and right, just for the fun of us so they can get a laugh, not to mention the ones who are participating by laughing at the whole damn thing. Well, I think they're pretty sad and pathetic. My mother raised me on better, uh, better matters than that. My grandmother raised me better than that. Unfortunately, the people who are doing the supporting of the bullies don't remember any of this because they probably haven't been taught by their grandmothers or their mothers about it. Or maybe themselves have already been bullied like that, and they like the idea of bullying other people because it makes them feel good. I don't know what their major malfunction is. So for me to post a video on the defense of a woman at this point over here, just so I can give the bully the other treatment, the thing of it is, I'm doing his same damn bully tactics. Got a senator from Georgia picked on a senator from California. It was a running mate for a potential presidential candidate. This guy thinks it's funny to make fun of a woman's name all the time. I thought the state he represented it actually had some smart people in it, and unfortunately... He's represented the opposite at this point. And I've got some relatives living out there who like that particular state, and unfortunately, I don't like to say anything bad about her particular state and the people that she likes and, and stays with. Only because I don't even like what's going on with some of those idiots in the first place. Now, I know my state of California already has idiots as it is. But for me to attack another senator because this particular senator who's no longer a man just considered a caricature of the Antichrist that people had voted into the current administration of the White House doesn't make it right for me to go after the silly son of a bitch. As much as I'd love to insult the living crap out of his name. Because I'll be nowhere, no, I will not be on that level. I won't sing the guy's praises either. I mean, a short snippet can actually do some character damage. But well, what this guy has done, I know the senator will be laughing it off at this point over here, but I know it hurts her like crazy. And I can take all the damn jokes they got. I can take the insults they've got. I can berate myself worse than them. I know what it's like to be bullied. But I will not allow another woman to be bullied like that. Women bashing? I know she's got more class and more character than this sorry son of a bitch who was doing a lead-in for the son of a bitch who's supposed to be a president but is really a womanizer and also a bully to women and they don't even feel it they don't even think it they still support him think he's a wonderful guy he's not a wonderful guy he's an asshole I'm not going to say he's a typical New Yorker New Yorkers are assholes I'm going to say this guy's an asshole I'm not going to pick on the state of New York at this point over here and say everybody in New York sucks. No. Say New York doesn't suck. But I'm going to say this particular asshole who was born in New York, who was supposedly who was supposed to be a president, doesn't act like it, acts like a damn bully all the frickin' time. I'm saying he's an asshole. 
anybody who supports this guy is an asshole. And I'm going to say this about the women as well. I don't like to insult and I don't like to belittle women unless, of course, they're already belittling themselves by associating themselves with an asshole. And then I don't have to insult their character because they have no character. You're going to believe in a cult figure that badly. You're welcome to them. You're only fooling yourself. I've known people who have better class, better taste, and better manners than those who actually celebrate a, and worship a cult leader. And for those who laugh, including those of the same sex, as someone who's getting picked on, they're no better than a cult leader. Because they have no character. They've lost it a long time ago. My mama didn't raise no fool. Neither did my grandma. They were born from different times and different eras. But at least they had values to install. Unfortunately, those values are not rubbing off on a hell of a lot of people. That's for sure. Because the people who actually grew up for those times are long gone. And those values are long lost in our generation. And seemingly the previous generation. You guys disgust me. See, if you want me to start making fun of your damn name, I don't have to. You've already lost. You're already bullies of yourselves. You just don't know it. You hate being bullied? Look in the mirror.